<sighs> yes, yes. I know you're all happy to see me out here. You know, it's been a while. Sean is back, as you know. That punk ain't here. It's my turn to take things over. But, you know, y'all gonna be a little sad. Because today isn't about me. Today is about me helping someone else. Seeing as the, it's the day before Valentine's Day. I, I decided to give my wisdom to someone else. So I'm being a wingman. Y'all know I got my wingman right here. So now it's time to help somebody else and be the wingman. I typically don't typically don't do this, but I'm feeling generous. And don't worry, because you know on Valentine's Day, I'm helping somebody else for Valentine's Day. I got plenty of women, so you know, for me, for Valentine's Day, I could pick anybody that I have already. So let's get into this. Yeah. Yo. It's time to be the wingman today. It's not about me, like I said, it's about who I'm helping out there. Give them tips, give them the confidence for this Valentine's Day coming up. I got y'all. Yo, super seducer. Y'all don't want to lose her. It's time to be the wingman. A for my man's A. He trying to get that girl over there. I ain't gonna mess up. I ain't gonna cock block. That's not how we do it. Matter of fact, screw it. Even though if that wasn't a good enough rap, it ain't about me, like I said. It's not about me. Alright. Your wingman isn't the smoothest. I mean, my wingman is always on point. But we're talking about, I guess, ours. But he's a good guy. And with your help, he'll finally get lucky. Do you have what it takes to be a great wingman? Did y'all really just ask me that question? If I could do it for me, I could do it for somebody else. Watch this. What type of guy is the best wingman? Ex-girlfriend. <laughs> My eyes immediately went to ex-girlfriend. Now you know that is the worst. <laughs> that is the worst. <laughs> Yo. Ugly guy who makes you look good by comparison. Well, that... Well, I don't know. I mean, I'm not saying that's a bad option because you know just because they're ugly per se, they can still be a good wingman and do do what they need to do for you. But I think in this case, it's going to have to be this one. See, I knew it. want to go out with someone that makes you look good. They should be, um, they should look pretty good if possible, yeah. at least dress well. Um, yeah. They should be someone that puts you in a good mood, has a positive energy. I mean, and if possible, you know, one could, that actually you know, dress likes well too. To so that's like very just freaking biased. Like that's very freaking stereotype. And I don't like that shit. But it's all right. Will you set up code words? Set up code words to use while talking to girls. Don't set up code words. I don't want to think on the fly. I want to be ready to do what I'm trying to do. So we're going to set up these words. Wait. But first, we need to set up some code words, right? Okay. So if you're talking to a girl, I I, but I then I you decide it for a second. you like that one, then you're going to say, this girl's crazy. And that means you like that girl. Okay. And then <laughs> if you like the other one and you want to do the switcheroo, you're going to say, I see, I oh, Richard, I was just doing. thinking about that time here. in Italy. All right, that yeah. one. And then I if you decide right that you don't Might like the well. girls, you can just say, I'm going to go to the bathroom. And then I'm going to say, okay, I'm going to go as well. Whatever, so right? So basically, that's doing it the nice way. If you like the girl and you want to take her home, then you can just say, what could you say? Uh, Does anyone want some chewing gum? All right? yeah. yeah. Perfect. So those are Ooh. our code words. Yeah. <laughs> they got that down packed. If you go out with your friend and you talk to lots of girls, you would find that you have situations where you said, I thought you liked her. No, no, I didn't. Well, why was I talking to her friend for 30 minutes? Ah, I don't know, I thought you liked your friend. So yeah, in order to thinking, avoid all these kinds thinking. of uh, miscommunications that can happen, it makes sense to just spend a little time thinking about the possible eventualities and coming up with the code words. Even though it does sound a bit geeky, don't it matter. actually really helps in practice. Geeky does not mean it's bad. just chilling so I'm guessing these are our two girls right here that we're gonna be focusing on Even though it looks Dude, like I don't know what it is but I feel like you're gonna get lucky tonight I oh, just he is. feel it yeah I feel it too man oh he is oh, oh look at those two 
Well, yeah. yeah. Which one do you like? Don't say the blonde one. I like one. the blonde one. Bruh. I don't know. I don't know what to I say. Would, to I her. like the blonde one. You Shit, dude. Go on, give it a go. No, like, I don't know. I don't want to be embarrassed. Hmm, all oh right. my gosh. See, it's kind of hard being a wingman when you like the girl that your, your friend likes. It's kind of hard to be a wingman that way, but we got to stay in control. Stay in control. Take a hundred dollars from him and say you'll only give it back if he approaches. And that'll make that yo. That'll really probably work. I probably don't even need to read these other answers. I, but I will. Tell him if he doesn't go out and talk to them, you will, and you'll speak loudly so that everyone can hear. That's embarrassing as freak. <laughs> I kind of want to see what. The, I mean, I don't think he's actually gonna do it. He's gonna tell him that, but tell him to give to have a shot to give him some confidence. No, because when you start getting drunk, you do dumb shit. Uh, you do dumb shit. Nah. We're, we're gonna try the hundred dollars. I'll tell you what, um, yep. have you got any cash, any notes? Just while we wait. Any yeah, notes? Probably, yeah, probably. I'm gonna show you a magic trick. Yeah. Here you go. Right, so I'm gonna take this hundred dollars, put oh. it in my pocket, and it's gonna make us <laughs> talk to those girls. Pressure, come because on. Because you're not getting it back until you talk to them. Well. You agree? <laughs> yeah. Okay. But cool. it worked. But it worked, you see? It worked. Rather than you guys just hanging out of the bar, not doing anything, and Yo, having a shitty night, I'm still, why not I'm still um, use this girls that as a way next to, to get each other talking in to In bras them. and panties, like they're just sitting there on the, on, the, on the bed like it's nothing. Like, I still just, <laughs> just think about that, because it's like you always see it. <sighs> that actually worked. I didn't think that would work. Alright, you're both going together. You going first to scope things out. Then your friend goes in. Your friend goes in while you wait a moment. This is about him, not about me. So let him go in. I knew Going in see, together is what maybe I am a good wingman. It doesn't work too well. Much better if one of you goes in, kind of warms things up. First. Yeah. That's how it's done. What should I say? Oh, and we gotta tell him what to say. Cause he said, yeah, he, okay. All right. Give him the, are you girls nail bashing line? What the hell? Tell him just to go up and grab her ass. <laughs> just to grab her ass is grab a whole bunch of that dump truck. Yeah, no, we're not doing that. Tell him to use the sorry I'm late. Traffic was crazy. Opener. They don't know you. How the fuck you gonna use that? And they don't even know you. Tell him to just be himself and talk about Star Wars. And in reality, I think that actually could work if you can just talk about your talk about yourself and be yourself but I think in here they're not gonna allow that because I've tried that before if uh, no I read that say to use the tried and tested engagement opener I've never heard of that but that sounds like it probably could work why don't you use the engagement opener oh yeah, yeah right. it's always they know what it is that's I like 102 percent chance so I'll do my best yeah man all right let's see how he does he likes a blonde oh. one. hi girls hey hi uh, can I ask you a question? Yeah, sure. Uh, my friend uh, dated a girl for a month, and I like uh, yesterday he proposed to her. Oh. Uh, do you think one month is enough time to figure it out everything about a person? I no. think yes. You think no? Yes. Why? Because it's too quick, you know. I don't think so. I'm happy for the girl. Well, I must agree with you. I think it's too soon. And by the way, my name is Greg. Hi, Greg. Vicky. Nice oh, to meet you. Nice to meet you too. And you? Monica. I know what he's oh, doing. it's nice to meet you. Monica. Nice to meet you too. You following me, Monica? Hold on, hold on. Wait. This is an opinion opener. I'm just, so it's I'm very tripping. engaging. Hence, you know, engagement opener. Uh, okay, but it's also just... very engaging. It gets you into a conversation. But I was if thinking, like, not super he, comfortable I know what he's trying to do. talking he's... to girls in bars. This <laughs> he... is a great one to start with. And he's it's doing a good it right. I see case. him. I see you, bruh. I see you. How long will you wait to join? Fuck. Now that's where you get tripped up because you could be, you could go in too late or too early. Which one would it be though? Okay. I think I figured it out. One minute sounds like it's too early, but then again, 10 minutes. Nah, because at that point he'll probably start freezing up like, okay, what do I do now? What do I do now? He's got to feed off of me, if you remember that. I'm supposed to be helping him. So let me just go in there. He's doing good right now, but got to go in You want to allow see? enough time for him to say something to the girls, get a response, go a little bit further than that, Boom. get them comfortable, uh, make sure that they feel good, and then you join exactly at that time. If it's too early or too late, 
um, it could be all wrong and mess things and up. Mess so the around whole a minute for both looks of y'all. right, but when they're kind of engaged in a conversation together, ideally smiling, you can get in there. Get in them is what he was trying to say. What will you say as you join them? Come in and say, "Sorry, is he bothering you?" Hey, mate. So who are these two? I see you met the local serial killer. <laughs> What? Local serial killer? <laughs> Are you trying to make everybody run away? Not even just them. I don't know if I want to pick some wrong answers today. I don't think I. I don't think I want to. I don't. <sighs> it's about to be Valentine's Day. I don't. I'm not picking wrong answers today. <laughs> but that is funny though. That is literally funny. I, I'm. I think that. I think that. <sighs> Sorry, is he bothering you? Might no, because it might be a little joke, but it, I don't think it'll work in this case. Hey, mate, we always say mate to it. He always say mate to him. So yeah, let's let's try that. Wow, what an amazing party! Yeah, such a nice club. Yeah, I like it. Always at a club. Mm-hmm. Hey, mate, who are these two? Oh, this is Vicky and Monica. Hey, hey, I'm Greg Spen Richards. Nice to meet you, Monica. Um, Monica, right? Nice yeah. to meet you. I nice to meet you. I think that's a good way to slide up in there. That's you correct, I mean. because you don't want to just that. talk to him, don't take that. the attention of the girls away, and it's maybe a bit strange to just suddenly start talking to the girls. So it's correct to quickly engage your friends, but ask him to introduce you, yeah. and then you can go on to talking to See? the girls. That's how we do it, man. Give attention to your friend, give attention to both girls, Give attention to the girl your friend doesn't like, or give attention to the girl your friend likes. Shit, shit. I'm I'm going more towards give attention to the girl your friend doesn't like because we're supposed to be a wingman. Let him talk to who the one who he likes. I, I, I think, I think I was right about give attention to the girl your friend doesn't like because why would I give attention to both girls? No, and why would I give attention to the one he likes? Like nah. And don't give attention to him because we're helping him out. This ain't just me and him there. We're trying to, yeah, right there. So what do you like to do in your free time? Well, I like reading. Yeah, what do you yeah. read? Well, now I read Harry Potter books. Ooh, Harry Potter. Really? Okay, yes. I might like, I might oh like you. Oh my god. No, that's bad. So it means you're like 12 years old? Yeah. Hey. 13. Wow. 14? No, no. No, no not even close. I thought only actually. young girls read Harry Potter. Don't even do that. No, have you ever read Harry Potter? Yo, yeah, I read the first one. For that one. Uh, didn't like it. And I watched the second like movie. Oh, oh, you know. Didn't like it. <laughs> I know it's popular, but I thought it was, you know, a children's thing. But no, absolutely not. I see what he's no. doing. Some good stuff. Yes, I think you should try. I, 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 I did like that she gave all the money to charity. So smart. Rowan, you know? yeah, 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 yeah. She's very cool. So yes, that's yeah, good. Yeah. So it's good that you're supporting. If you did, you pay for it or you? For boost? Yeah, or yes. you download yeah. it. No, 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 no. I paid. That's I bought, good. I, cool. I, I think this is going well. I think this is going well. Well done, you're being a good wingman. That's exactly right. Um, you want to help him out this time? Maybe he'll help you out this next oh, time. Oh, he better. And I mean, by not talking to it, the but other like, girl exclusively, you, know, I mean. you free him up to do his thing do with your the girl thing, that he's into. Boy. Do your thing, partner. Tell her about Fifty Shades of Grey and Sex Dungeons. <laughs> it's rare to read books these days. Well done. You most of the talking about your reading. I don't know. Hmm. It's rare to read books these days. Well done. I think he might want to compliment her on that. I like reading too, actually. Oh, see? Don't you think it's rare these days? Like, everyone's on Instagram and just distracted Which is by true. stuff. Well, you Everybody know, maybe, but my friends read all the, the time, so... Club. Yeah. Oh, yeah. actually, yeah. Yeah. we should start a reading club. <laughs> yeah, I think so. <laughs> yeah, just, I think they do that, right? Like, everyone reads the same book and then he yeah. talks about... Yeah, it's actually, actually, it's pretty cool. Oh, you if you can agree on the book. Do that now. Well, not much, really. You know, you share your opinion. Oh, it's pretty cool yeah. to, yeah. Really okay. to discuss it. Yeah. Well, anyway, it's rare for me to meet someone that likes reading. It's yeah. pretty cool. Okay. So, yeah. well I think you have a very nice voice. <laughs> yes. I'm hearing him say you have a very nice voice When you're to her. being the wingman, you want to make your girl He's feel good there. and comfortable. He's that means up that there. you don't need to do so much teasing and things like that, but you do need to give some compliments, have a friendly conversation, and basically talk her in nicely enough so that she's happy to talk to you, but maybe not too much so that she likes you. Now, how do we do that, though? How do you find By that the way, balance? What are you drinking there? Champagne. It's yeah. pretty good, actually. Oh, cool. 
Cheers. Cheers. Oh, he don't have, we don't have drinks. Yeah, cheers oh, to y'all. Uh, let me get you another one. Oh, thank you. Oh. My man took charge by himself. <laughs> oh my gosh. No, I didn't expect him to say that. Like he was all, he was all shy, all like I don't know what to say. But as soon as he saw that, he he took charge. That's what, that's what it's all about. You take charge. I, I'm no, I'm proud of him for that. Like I really, I'm really proud of him for that. And I'm not even his real wing man. He is. But like, if I saw my, if I saw my boy doing that, I'd be like surprised. I wouldn't show it. But I'd be like, dang, yeah, he he did that. He did that. All right. Tell the girls an embarrassing story about him. Nah, nah, that that nope. Tell his girl that he likes her. She's a lucky girl. Tell them about a great book you recently read. Try to steal both girls for a threesome. <laughs> no. Tell a story about a time when you he really helped you out and why you were best friends. I think it's that one. We have to help while he's gone. We have to talk great about him. You know, Greg, he's actually my best friend. Such a great guy because. You know, I've got lots of friends, but you never know who would really be there They're for like you, so, right? Like but there was this one time saying. where I just had this horrible situation, broke up with my ex-girlfriend, and I called him at like four in the morning, and he said, I'm going to be there right away. And oh, he got wow. out of bed. Who knows if he actually did this or not? Who and knows? He was talking to me, you know, all through the morning and stuff, didn't sleep, and it really made me feel better. And I knew because he could have said, oh, I've got to sleep, I'm busy, I'm going to work. Definitely could have did that because that's really definitely there probably what so, happened. Since that day, he I realized, tries. you know, he's a super guy. And, yeah, that's yeah. Why he's so here. nice to have such a wonderful friend. You hear yeah. that? You hear that, Blondie? You know what that means. This is one of the most powerful moments in the you entire should. game. I'm, I'm enjoying this too much. If I you am. can do this kind of thing for your friends, and if they can do it for you, it has a huge effect. When you say nice. things about yourself, it's bragging. It's yeah, bad. why would I brag but about when myself and helping somebody else? something about you, it it's make sense, incredibly right? powerful. So think about something nice that you can say about your wingman and try it next time. Well, that's the whole point of being a yeah, wingman. So that's good anyway. I'll, look, hey, Rich, he needs my help. I'll just get the jinx. Hang on a second. Uh oh. You know they're going to talk. All right. Got you know girls talk. Yeah. double. Oh, they ain't talking. I thought they were talking, but you know what? They're, they're thinking something. There you go. You know they're oh, thinking thank something. You. Thank you. So, so cheers. cheers, everyone. Cheers. cheers. You know what they're thinking. I'm, I'm just I can't. Like, I can't. This is... Yeah. It's a nice one. Mm -hmm. I bet it you is. Drink champagne. Yes, I really yeah. like it. Yeah? What yeah. about cocktails? Yeah. Oh, no, that's yeah. No. Beer? Vodka, I mean, How about beer? I don't know. No. Oh, no. Yeah, no. Like that taste. smells disgusting. Yeah, I don't like beer at all, actually. Yeah. Strange, but... Yeah. Hang on a second. Oh, it's my mum. Yeah. It was her birthday yeah. today. She wow. just said, like, thanks again. Did he just pull that out of his ass? Like, was it Whoa, real? she's so pretty. Oh, she she young, really right? was. That's like, why you're so handsome. Oh! Totally didn't expect that to come out of her mouth. Okay. Now we might have something. Now we might actually want this girl to like us. Because before, it was just like to help him out. But she's saying the stuff about us that's like that. She's saying we handsome. That that's what that's that's what you gotta be like for a second. You just gotta turn off the turn off the coldness. Well, not exactly coldness, but you know what I mean. Like turn off that. You know, trying to help him out and just thinking like maybe I could get this girl while helping him out. Two for two, you know. Like that's a win-win. Be cold and tell her you have a girlfriend. No, no, that that'll fuck it all up. That I, I can already tell. Tell her you have a girlfriend, but you can still have sex. That'll definitely not work. No girl wants to. No girl wants to be with somebody that has a girlfriend. That that's usually not gonna work. No, especially nowadays. Well, actually, no. Nowadays, it's actually probably the opposite. But. No, we, we classy around here. Game her to the same extent as if you really liked her. We got to. We got to. Thank you. That's nice of you to say. And actually, you're so pretty. You've got Thank such a you. sweet smile. Like, we, Thank we got you. to hear. There's nothing wrong with you. But you're a little though, bit shy, too, right? So like, Am I right? Maybe a little bit. Oh, but that's cute. I like shy girls. Ooh. Thank you. Yeah, shy girls are normally good girls. <laughs> But this, what is it they say? It's always the quiet ones. Yo, why am I tearing up? Right English Yo, I'm expression. Too much. The, the quiet ones are trouble. 
Well, maybe it's true. Yeah, true about you? Maybe. Oh, all right. Did she just say what I thought she said? The worst situation here is if your girl gets bored and wants to leave and drags his girl away. Exactly. And girls often do that because they're way more loyal than guys. So well, wait, you need to keep your girl interested. Don't say and that. so as far as That's you can without you being say. dishonest, you want to work hard to make her like you. But we don't actually like her though. I don't know. Like he said game her as if you actually like her. But I guess he's not like trying too hard. He's not trying too hard. I think that's what they were trying to say. Keep the girls side by side. Turn the girl away from her friend by moving around to the outside. I think, I think, I think, I think. Hold on, let me think it for a second. I think, I think, I think this is the time to get her away from her friend so he could do his thing and she won't, it'll be harder for her to pull her friend to the side and be like, like, we, we, we work on our magic here. When the see girls this? can see each other, they can find a moment, you know, where there's a lull in the conversation um, exactly. and they can get out of there. Yeah, you if ain't you turn out of them there, so away easy. so they can't see each other without kind of, uh, looking you know, back. looking back, then it makes it much harder for the conversation to break up and we don't want for that either party as long man as is they can't see each other. So it's the correct option. And maybe so am I. What food do you like? Well, I am a vegetarian mm. for six years now. Oh, can you believe it? Six you still years? Alive? Yes, as you see. <laughs> okay. No, but seriously, do you feel healthier with it? Yes, actually, I feel much better. Okay. It seems quite um, trendy at the moment. And I saw lots of documentaries like this one, Cowspiracy, Forks Over Knives. And it's all, you know, about how eating meat is bad for the environment. True. Having plant proteins or whatever is better, so... That's cool. And you've, you're a healthy person in general then? Well, yes, I think oh, so. And yeah, actually, I, I so. really love animals, so I just I can't eat them, them, you know. <laughs> Do you have some animals? Yes, I have a dog. Okay. Okay. What about you? No, I, I have fish. I have an oh. aquarium with fishes. Hey, that's still, nice. that's still a pet. Yeah, they're beautiful. That's still a pet. It's all right. Find out logistics. If they live together and if they work the next day, Tell her about your hunting safari in South Africa or talk about her hobbies. Ooh, ooh. It's either B or A. It's, it's got to be one of those. Oh, that's hard. Um, maybe it could go either way. But if they, live, if they work the next day, because if, they wanna, if he wants to see her again, that'd be perfect. But let's, let's see if this works. And is Vicky vegetarian? Well, no. no? She likes meat. Okay. Yeah, she does. But do you live together? No, no. Don't, okay. No, don't. don't even mind that. Do you, who do you live with? Fucking off. <laughs> <laughs> well, I live alone actually. Okay, that's good. And tomorrow, actually, what do you do? You guys work? Are you working tomorrow? Well, I think no. No, yeah, you're both free. That, that's yes. cool. Well, that's nice. Get tomorrow, to relax. Yes. I mean, that, I've got to work, but it's okay. Not, doesn't matter if I'm tired. <laughs> 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 Anytime you're meeting girls out in the night, then you want to find out stuff like whether they live together. You know, all this stuff comes under logistics. And it's very logistics. important when it comes to uh, deciding on the next steps and if you'd be able to notes. take these girls somewhere else or to your house. I got my peeps and I got my swag. Seems like they're getting on very well together. That's good. Yeah, I think so. I like it. I like it. I like it. I like it. Leave the group? No. I. Offer to take pics and direct him to touch her up. What the hell? You doing so good, then you f fuck it up at them? That's not what we're doing. Tell your friend, your girl, how good they look together and encourage the connection. Ooh, this is getting juicy. Did you know I'm a licensed pastor? I think you should marry, I should marry you guys right now. Oh, no, 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 I'm not gonna read that because I know that ain't the right answer at all. Okay, well, my work here is done. You guys have fun. I think it's this one because if you encourage it and she sees it too then y'all gonna be like yeah yeah that is true and I'll make things better that's how I'm doing it yeah they look great together first they're actually yeah. both quite tall so they match like that because he actually likes tall girls and it's so hard yes. for him to find someone in his height that's right. I mean, so she's she's such a nice guy. How is she? Is she a good girl? She's a wonderful girl. I yeah. think your friend is very lucky. Oh. Alright, well hopefully they, you know, they make it. Let's just chill and see what happens. Yeah. Yeah. 
This mm -hmm. is very nice. You're not saying it publicly, you're not saying it to her, but you're saying it to the friend because you know that after this interaction, they're going to speak about him of and you want the girl speak that about. you're talking to to be saying very nice things about your friend. So it's the correct choice. Nice one. That's what, all it's, that's what it's all about. Let your friend decide what to do next. So just, okay, that's never the option. I'm not even going to read B because I read it quickly before I even said it out my mouth. But yeah, never that. You suggest going somewhere else. Persuade your girl to do so that she persuades her friend. Oh. 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 We cannot let him decide what to do next because we're still being his wingman. So we still are helping him out. So let me let me do Monica, all. what do you think? Let this place is getting a bit yeah. dull, right? Yeah. Maybe we should make a move after party time, yeah? I think it's a good idea. Right, let's yeah. get Nico yeah. and Greg and get out of here. Yeah. yeah. Guys, go yeah. for after party. Yeah, it will be yeah, great. Come on, come on. Is it she wants. Yes. Yeah. 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 Okay. Think, think right. Right. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Okay, let's go. All right, let's go. Oh, he's already <laughs> hugging. Oh, okay. All right. Brilliant. This is exactly the way to do it. Um, you don't want to leave it to him, and you want to first persuade your yeah. girl so that like said, there's two people that already want to do the thing. Then your friend will be free and. The final girl is going to agree to she it. She was a because, little skeptical you know, at first. She's just going to be out there. Not going to lie to you. The super seducer Raiden. No well, wrong answers. That makes you look good. They should I'm a be. Um, they should, should look pretty good. My if props. possible. y'all. I didn't know how much of a wingman I thought. I didn't know how much of a wingman I thought I'd be. I didn't know I'd be that good. But obviously, if I'm like I said, if I'm that good talking to girls and getting them with me that I can help other people do the same that was a perfect run we probably had perfect runs before but this one felt like different because Valentine's Day is tomorrow just helping somebody else and I hope y'all find if y'all don't have a, a significant other already for Valentine's Day I hope y'all get a valentine's and y'all have a great time or even if you don't even if you are by yourself just hope that it's not like hope that you're not lonely because there's a difference between being alone and lonely i just hope that you're not lonely on valentine's day because nobody wants to be that nobody all right let me just figure out what do we have to do next because as we, we do every episode we figure out what's next office and then first date Kate I mean we already knew that she was going to be having a first date because I remember last time we did check that out but that's the last one and you already know we ain't, we ain't done Super 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 Seducer 2 is is on and popping after this one and yes it'll be me hosting it of course not Sean but office, back to the office shit. How the hell am I gonna work up the courage? Not the courage, how am I gonna get somebody in an office where that's literally the worst scenario you could be in? I'm gonna have to really work my magic for that one. But I think we can do it. All right, y'all. That was this, we were successful, obviously. I hope to see y'all next time. Stay thirsty, my friends. Yeah! <laughs>